This is your ABC Starter Kit. Everything you need to know about Eli Stone. That's me. You're talking about me. For starters, Eli Stone is about... Oh my God, someone told you. Eli Stone. Absolutely. He's a prominent San Francisco lawyer and quite possibly a modern-day prophet. I think I'm a prophet, like Moses. A prophet is defined as a person who foretells future events by or as if by supernatural means. God's go-to guy. Eli sees visions and uses these visions and the law to help him help others. Eli Stone, lawyer, prophet. Talk about dumb luck. Let's run through the ABCs, three things you absolutely need to know about Eli Stone. What is this, multiple choice? A, Eli's visions were possibly caused by a brain aneurysm. That is, a balloon-like bulge in a blood vessel in his brain. Want to get all trivial pursuit? Bring it. B, Eli's medical condition is hereditary. He inherited it from his father, who also had visions, and predicted Eli's future. You're meant to do great things. C. Eli Stone is not religious, but his name is. Eli is a variation on the name of God, as spoken in Aramaic. You spend a lot of time on Wikipedia, don't you? Now you'll need to know the players, so here's the starting lineup. You don't need to be Nostradamus to figure out where to start, because the show is all about Eli Stone, lawyer, prophet. It's like buying a hybrid. There's Eli's loyal assistant. Howdy! There's an intercom, Brando. I swear, it's like we work in a cleaner. Taylor, major hottie, Eli's former fiance, and a lawyer who never met a client she couldn't what? handle. Pete, shake hands with Taylor Weathersby, your new lawyer. Don't worry, you can thank me later with fewer clothes on. Matt Dowd, another lawyer and Eli's chief rival at the firm. Mr. Dowd, you're atypically quiet. Yeah, sorry, I was just redecorating Stone's office in my head. Maggie, she's a young lawyer, just starting out, but very eager. Why are you sitting at my desk? I'm getting a feel for it. Maybe too eager. Jordan Weathersby, senior partner at WPK, a no-nonsense, old-school, hard-as-nails lawyer. I'm gonna win this case because that's what I do for my clients. Nate is a doctor and Eli's older brother. You have conjoined butts in your cranium which it makes you a double butthead. <laughs> and Dr. Chen, holistic healer, acupuncturist, and Eli's spiritual guide. It's kind of trippy, isn't it? Now let's make some connections. After law school, Eli went to work for WPK. Eli! He got the big office, the fancy car, the girl, and one night he had a vision. You hear that music? It's coming from the living room. I'm glad something's coming! Cause I gotta have friends. Of George Michael? He went to see Nate, who diagnosed Eli's brain aneurysm. I'm so sorry, Eli. Patty sent Eli to Dr. Chen, who knew immediately what he was dealing with. There are those who are sent to us to help us find our way. Some people call them prophets. Eli continued to have visions and began to accept them. My visions, they guide me. They tell me what kinds of cases I should take or what I should do. His behavior, though, made him an outcast at the firm and with his boss. We're done. He lost the big office, the fancy car, and then he lost the girl. Are you breaking up with me? Just when he thought he'd lost everything. During your last trial, you interrupted your opening argument to sing a song. You're looking at sanctions and possible disbarment. Jordan, who still had feelings for Eli, came to his rescue. I hired you. I mentored you. I've always thought you were the future of this firm. Nate found a doctor to remove Eli's aneurysm, but it would be risky. Blindness. Coma. Long-term memory loss. How attached are you to your ability to speak? But before the surgery, Eli had a vision that there would be an earthquake. And to save his friends, he decided to tell the world. Hello! I have it on very good authority that in about an hour from now, there's going to be an earthquake. A big one. The big one. I guess he wasn't so crazy after all. With everyone safe, Eli went into surgery for his aneurysm. He slipped into a coma, and while his friends waited, Eli had one final vision. I don't want to be dead. Dead, dead, dead. Oh, man. Are you God? Well, some men have said so. I don't know how to get back. Sure you do. You've always known. I have? But does he? Can he find his way? And if so, what about his visions? Will they die so he can live again? Has it all been a dream? What lies ahead, only time will tell. You're off to a good start with Eli Stone. Eli Stone, season one available on DVD September 2nd. Catch up anytime with full episodes available at abc.com. And mark your calendar for an all new season of Eli Stone, premiering Tuesday, October 14th at 10, 9 central on ABC.